The big difference between Hobbs and traditional model makers is that most model makers outsource 3D printing, whereas we have direct access to SLA machines, which means that we can produce the models in-house at a much lower rate than you would have to do if you went to a traditional model makers. What it means is we can produce models faster, we can produce models cheaper, and they're much higher quality than a traditional model. It largely removes all of the hand making elements of it and then we just add the final details at the end. We've recently invested in a large format laser cutter which works really well with the SLA machine as they're both equally accurate forms of CAD. Cuts the cost down but it also means that we can do a lot of the techniques that traditional model makers do as well as glazing and large scale baseboards but also finer details as well like railings and um, elevations. We have a complete spray booth on site which means we can offer all the traditional finishes, stone, pavement, brick, as well as high-end metallics which is quite popular with product models. We offer really high quality white finishes which are very popular with architects for in-house models, as well as frosting and uh, lacquers to enhance the 3D prints that we make. The one thing that 3D printing can't do yet is produce things in wood. So. A lot of architects still like veneered models, wooden models, of which we've got the full capability to make in our in-house model shop. It's incredibly easy to add LED lighting to 3D prints, especially our iPro 8000, which is clear, so it can show lighting through it. The biggest difference between Hobbs and a traditional model makers is that we focus on the latest technology. We're not constrained by old ideas and old ways of making models. And what that means is our models are made faster, cheaper and of a higher quality.